Hey, you ever feel like you're constantly running on empty because you're giving too much of yourself to everyone else? You're not alone. In a world that never stops demanding your time and energy, learning to set boundaries is the ultimate power move. Let's talk about how to become a boundary boss and protect what matters most, your well-being. Setting boundaries is all about knowing your limits and communicating them clearly. It's about saying no without guilt and understanding that you don't have to be available 24-7. Protecting your time and energy isn't just about self-care. It's about ensuring that you have the resources to be your best self for the people and projects that truly matter to you. Start by identifying the areas in your life you feel most drained. Is it at work, with certain relationships, or in your personal time? Once you've pinpointed the problem areas, it's time to create boundaries that give you the space you need to recharge. Remember, a boundary isn't about shutting people out. It's about creating a healthy balance that allows you to thrive. But here's where it gets tricky. Setting boundaries can be uncomfortable, especially if you're not used to it. You might worry about disappointing others or fear that you'll come off as selfish. The pressure to say yes and meet everyone's expectations can make it difficult to stand your ground. How do you navigate these feelings and stay firm in your boundaries, even when it feels challenging? I used to struggle with setting boundaries, too. I felt like I had to be there for everyone all the time until I realized it was taking a toll on my health and happiness. But when I started setting clear boundaries like not answering work emails after hours and carving out time for myself, I noticed a huge difference. I had more energy, felt more in control of my life, and was able to show up more fully for the things and people I cared about. So, my friend, don't be afraid to set boundaries. It's one of the most empowering things you can do for yourself. Start small, be consistent, and remember that it's okay to put your well-being first. By protecting your time and energy, you're not just surviving, you're thriving. <laughs>